Hey everybody, let's take a look at some of the new features in our next-gen dozer. Now, I've got the cat grade with 3D in this tractor, and this happens to be the latest version of the software, which is 1.11. So I want to go in here and I want to show you some of the new designs that you can create. So push and hold on my design there. It's going to pop up, and I'm going to create an infield design. All right, and I'm going to go into designs and show you two of the new designs that we can do. So the first one is just going to be a level. All right, so this is a simple level. I'm choosing my uh, my right uh, blade tip as my focus, and I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to say here uh, for my uh, my elevation, so I can get that uh, that set up there. So hit save, confirm that. Now I went ahead and created just a really simple design in there that we can go ahead and set up. Simple flat plane design, nothing to it. Let's also go in and let me show you the other style of design that we can do as well too here. So I'm going to do create slope. Slope is new for us as well, too, so I'm going to focus on my right tip, and I'm going to say here is where we're at. Um, now I'm going to go next, and what it's asking me to do is, is it's asking me to set a second point so that we can set our uh, so we can set our main fall. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, change the northing here, uh, 303.179. Let's go 304,000, same elevation. That's going to go ahead and give me uh, an alignment there. All right, now the type of slope that we're looking for here. Let's go ahead and put a 2% on the left, and let's go ahead and put a 5% on the right. Now we've set the cross slope of both of those planes, and it's going to ask us to name that, and so let's just call that dual slope. And boom, we've created a simple dual slope design. I can go ahead and select that dual slope and load that up in my grade control menu. So it's got my two slopes set up there. You can see nice and nice and slow on those designs, nice and uh, simple slopes on those. And so that's a couple simple ways that you can do some easy designs right in the monitor of your next gen cat grade with 3D machine.